second place at a minimum, you would suggest, for the world champion if he wants to make the semi-finals this evening. Hasn't been easy. Robert Lambert with three second places so far. Here we go. Number 15. What a start it is from Smarty. He piles himself to the front. Here comes Lambert round the outside. Will he get the better of the world champion? Not quite. So uh, Smarslick out in front, being chased hard by Robert Lambert back in second place. Here comes Lingren round the outside. Smarslick has trusted that inside line on the opening lap. But Freddie Lingren, high and wide. Lambert trying to close the door, but Lingren now back in the second place. Oh, Lingren keeps it on, squeezes through the smallest of gaps as they come into turn three. He's sticking with the outside line. He's almost committed, stuck there now. And he's not able quite to reel in Smarzik. Smarzik, no confidence in the bike. Here comes Lingren. He's going to have the speed this time. Looking for the cutback. This is going to get tight. Oh, Lingren now just finds no way through. Smarzik having to ride with eyes in the back of his head here. Freddie Lingren on the march in second place. Smarzik just about hanging on out in front. But here comes Lingren again. One last chance. Round the outside in the final corner. In heat number 15. They roar to the line. Smarzlik hangs on. Again, he had to ride very, very hard there. Had to use all his skill there to hold Freddie Lingren at bay. Lingren was coming at him like a steam train there. At times, the world champion comes through in style. Back-to-back -back race wins for Bartel Smarzlik. Three points for him. Strong ride from Freddie Lingwood in second place. Two points. Robert Lambert back in third. And Yankovic misses out in heat 15. We thought it was going to be a tear up. And so it proved. But that man once again the world champion. Well, showing why he is a world champion. This was superstar. Yeah, he's battling very hard for all of these points. But another race win and that's what counts. Creeps around the inside. He thought that was where he was going to be quickest. And he's certainly done the first two and a half laps without really moving off the inside line at all. But uh, Freddie Lingren, he had to battle to get himself into a position to go after Smarslik. He had to work hard for the first lap and a half with Robert Lambert. Really not a lot of room a couple of times. But uh, riding confidently, putting the back wheel in the dirt early, riding it right around the outside. There it gets tight. Has to straighten the bike up to avoid the fence with his handlebars. But uh, typical Freddie Lingren style, he keeps it on, he goes after Swarzlick. Look at that. Uh, yeah, it's brilliant stuff. It's almost long to look like you there, Kelvin. Yeah, love it. Fantastic <laughs> stuff. I thought for a moment he was going to get the better of him here. Yeah. But uh, Schmarslick just had enough to close the door. But only just. Only just, but he had to use all his skill, all his uh, determination to make sure that Freddie Lingren didn't get the better of him. We saw that in Gorjov, of course, in the final where Freddie did. He hasn't got the speed he uh, previously has had.